up y'all okay so we just bought the cheapest diesel dump truck that we could find on marketplace we're going to pick it up right now hopefully we can get that thing to drive an hour back home to our house here and i'm gonna take y'all along for the ride so let's go check it out let's do this about an hour away from home we gotta go pick her up Okay. I'll top it off. How much gas is in there? How much diesel? I don't know. I think it's pretty full. Okay. Well, we can find out in a minute. I, th I, I think I filled up not long ago, and then I, I haven't used it, so. Right. And like I said, I'll take any of the parts that you got yeah, for that, it. Yeah, the sides. I threw your uh, your rockers in here. Okay. So that's in, oh, and, and the window. Yeah, okay, sweet. And I think that was everything. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Get it up here. It loves glow plugs. Huh? It loves glow plugs. But diesel doesn't. No, this truck loves glow plugs. <laughs> glow plugs cycle a couple times. got it um we're looking not too bad i'm not gonna spend too much time out here looking at it it's raining and i just want to get home i'm like an hour away so we're just gonna hope and pray that this thing can make us there one thing that i did notice is that this clutch pedal is just a little soft there's definitely not a lot of resistance on that which you know it could be anything really um, but we'll check that out. So I'll give you guys a little bit of an update as we're driving home. But other than that, the truck looks pretty good. We're going to find some time. We're going to find some time to uh, do a little once over on this whole vehicle here. But as for now, let's just get ourselves situated. So we can get this home without any issues. Right there. Clutch pedal definitely a little soft. Throw the seatbelt on just in case. Ooh, it's my first Chevy, my first diesel. Or I guess it's not a Chevy, it's a GMC. But my first GM vehicle. And the shift pattern's a little bit different than my old truck, so I'm a little bit, uh... Anyway, let's just get home. Alright. And so, it's got the low forward first gear. And that fucking uh that gas pedal is very sensitive. I don't know. It seems to not want to go into first when we're moving.
cruising. Hopefully not cruising for a bruising. I don't like how soft that clutch pedal feels. That's just a little bit of a little bit weird for me. I'm not exactly used to that. My old truck, I would have to push that clutch pretty hard to get that thing to do a little engagement. This thing is like feels like zero fucking resistance. Zero resistance. But let's just make it up. speed low is super low one is still very low two is low and three is like two basically it's really like a two speed Exactly how I'm feeling about this whole deal yet. goes in so softly I mean I feel like there should be some type of resistance on there I'm not sure if it's hydraulic or if it's manual or not another thing it doesn't seem to go into gear very easily when you're cruising so the 
windshield wipers work. What we'll probably end up doing, first thing, I'm going to inspect that transmission and clutch. I suspect either it just needs adjustment or possibly a new pressure plate. as well. Touchy gas pedal. Touch that thing and it just revs up super high. And it is a little bit tough to find first gear. Just grind them till you find them, baby. Grind them till you find them.
window here at all. Not good. Alright, I can see absolutely nothing out of that passenger side window, so I can't tell if anybody's on my right. Is it worth it? Did we fucking make a bad deal? We got brand new tires all the way around. Well, it's raining out here. I think that the next part of this video, um, we're not gonna do anything to this. Uh, that was just kind of the getting it home process on the next part of this, next installment of this video. We will uh, dive into this a little bit deeper and see if we can figure out anything specifically that needs to be replaced, what we can do to kind of bring this thing back up to speed a little bit, and let, we'll figure out if we actually made a good deal or not. So as for now, we're gonna let this go. Looks like we're not doing too bad. And yeah, that was a, uh, you guys so stay tuned to see more on this thing and what we what we can uh what we can do with it